September 20th. I got a call from this guy. He's got an oil burner that uh, keeps tripping out, won't run. And he said he's got other issues also, some leaks around the boiler and um, a few issues, he said. So we're going to go over there and see what's going on with it. Get the guy heat and hot water. Stay tuned. I got this boiler here. Relief valve's leaking. That thing's full of water. That's what the problem is. Expansion tank's bad. Got it hanging off the side of the boil like that. Things tripping on safety. Oil tank's way over there. He's got no protected oil line. That's going to be upgraded. This guy's got issues. <clears throat> Alright guys, before I change this and put this OSV valve in here for the oil line, I want to take this cartridge out of here and uh, blow the oil line back from the boiler to clear this line with my CO charge. Filter's a little nasty, so I took the filter out and I'll hook up my CO charge on the other side and I'll blow it back. Alright guys, I got my CO charge and I got that line disconnected. Okay, and I just have to open up the oil tank and uh, then I'll be able to blow it back. It's way down there. I don't know if you can see the tank, but it's pretty far away. Well, I got the filter out. And I'm going to go over there and open up that CO charge. You'll hear it blow through. Flaring tool. I like about this one, you don't even have to worry about reaming it. Just crank it down. in my truck to get this fitting out. Sometimes it just is easier. Let's see. Let's see if it comes off. I'll get this oil in this tank. I don't want to make a flipping mess. The last thing I want to do is break that nipple off. This OSV valve does oil safety valve. The oil pump's got to pull a good vacuum or it won't open. So, in other words, if the pipes rotted in the floor from going through the concrete, it won't open. It's 
it saves the house from losing all the oil into the ground. I'm going to have that or a protected oil line only that has a sleeve on it. In my state, no more. No more um, copper lines in contact with concrete. The insurance companies won't pay anymore. One of these jobs goes bad. It's three hundred and three hundred thousand dollars plus to clean up the, the mess. They come in here with jackhammers and jackhammer the the concrete up, and it can be a disaster. five minutes. Yeah. 
saying good draft very much. I think we'll go off the bat. Yeah, we had a good draft. Once we reach, that's good. Zero. I think we'll go. Oh, 
Сначала... Tank. I was V though on the one away. I'm gonna bleed the air out stairs after. Anyway guys, I bled all the air out upstairs, fixed the damper. Getting a good draft over the fire. Feeder. And a new OSV valve. This job is done. Alright, thanks for watching.